Hi, I'm Kathleen Erla Johnson of Creative Solace Studios. In this edition of my top five in five minutes, I'll be talking about five mindfulness toys that I like to use. There's so many little relaxation gadgets out there. These are things that I like to keep near my art desk if I need a quick break or to refocus. They help me to relax, focus, and be mindful. They can also help my fingers if they're feeling stiff, and sometimes I use them for meditation. Personally, I don't use these for having excess fidgety energy, but they could help with that as well. In addition, each toy has a bit of mental symbolism for me. The first mindfulness toy that I like is the good old-fashioned stress ball. This one has some bumps on it. I use this to take a break from whatever I might be doing. One symbolism while you're squeezing it is to release or get out any frustrations or extra energy. Another symbolism for me is that it can help in the brainstorming process or generating of ideas. If I squeeze it faster, sometimes my brain kicks in and works faster. A second mindfulness toy that I like is the fidget marble. There's a little marble inside of this mesh casing and it can just be squeezed back and forth. This can help to focus my thoughts more specifically than a stress ball because it involves more fine motor detailed movements, which I relate to more detailed or specific thinking or intention setting. My third favorite mindfulness toy is a throwback to my childhood. In the 70s and early 80s, this water toy was pretty popular. The movement of the pieces through the water helps to soothe me and helps my thoughts to flow just like the water flows. It can represent a current of energy, thoughts, or calmness, or even creativity. Playing the game of getting one ball into each cup also symbolizes completing a project from start to finish. My fourth favorite mindfulness toy is a Hoberman sphere. I use this for mindful breathing techniques, inhaling with expanding, and exhaling with contracting. It's really calming and pretty to look at. For me, the movement of the Hoberman sphere represents the movement, the gears of life and of the universe, kind of like the mathematics of the world. A fifth mindfulness toy that I enjoy is good old fashioned bubbles. It's also nice if I choose to blow them outside to get a little break in nature during the day. The lightfulness of watching bubbles float through the air is so peaceful and joyful at the same time. It can also represent releasing thoughts and letting go of things that no longer serve me. So those are my top five mindfulness toys in five minutes. These objects bring a bit of childlike joy and levity to my day while also symbolizing deeper concepts as I use them.